account on postman and make sure that you sign in with your account i know that you can do that so after uh, signing in to your postman simply go to this icon right click on this to manage our environments you can see that i already have three environments here that is from my previous projects so now i want to add my new environment for shop it project so simply click on here add type here the environment name i simply type here shop it like this down in the variable i simply type here domain and give it value http slash slash local host port 4000 right so now this is the initial value for this variable because i don't want to add local host port 4000 again and again on every route instead i will use this name that is domain you can type anything here and also you can type any url here whatever you have so after adding it simply click on add now it is successfully added now you can simply go to here and click on shop it so now you are in shop it environment and also we can simply click on here in the collections click on new collection and type here shop it like this and the description i recommend you to write long descriptions in detail but in this video i'm not going to do that because i don't have enough time for that so simply type here full e-commerce site in MERN and simply click on here create so this is created successfully this collection and in this collection I click right click on it and click on add folder and type here folder name that is called products so it will contain all the routes related to the products so I simply type here all routes related to products simply click on create from here so now you can see that we have a folder here called products so now let's save this route in this folder and i also simply remove this from here and type here the domain our this that contains if you hover over it you can see its value localhost port 4000 so slash api oops api slash v1 slash products all right so simply click on save before that if i click on send from here you will see the same result so simply click on save and i want to save it in shop it products and i want to name it like get all products and i simply type here get all products in the database like that and click on save to products and now you can see that in products we have our one route that is get route that is get all products so now whenever you come back you can simply click on it and you don't have to do anything you can simply click on send and that's it all right so now you have simply set up your postman for the development so i hope that you understand so now in my next video i will connect to my mongodb database and then we will start adding our products in our database all right so i will see